What is going on people? It is your guy James Roth. Thank you guys so much for checking out this video. Today's video, I'm going to tell you guys all the facts, all the details that we know about the Yeezy 700 MNVN. I really hope I said that correctly. Cause we all know Yeezys, they got a ton of weird names and abbreviations and code names, but you guys know what I mean. There is a lot of hype kind of building up with this shoe and if you plan on buying this shoe soon, you're gonna wanna watch this video, I promise you. I would not disappoint you guys. Now the first thing I wanna tell you about this sneaker is that this sneaker is very different from the 700 V1s and V2s. The Yeezy 700 V1 still got the bulky, super big midsole and it also has the most multi-layer uppers. It has a combination of suede, mesh, and leather. The Yeezy 700 V2s is made the same exact way, but the only difference is, is in the upper. The upper is made with a lot more mesh than the V1s. You can actually see it a lot more than the V1s. And the shoe itself is a lot more bulkier and a lot more stiffer, while the V1s is a lot more soft. Now, the difference between these sneakers and the V3s is quite obvious. The sneaker is just totally different. Got the exoskeleton inside panels and also the sneaker is not equipped with any boost technology it's like Yeezy came up to the guys who designed this shoe was like yo listen I want to build a cheaper 700 and the guys was like okay cool cool well no boost for you then now with these brand new Yeezy 700s M and V ends the sneaker is actually same it's like 50 50 this sneaker is like a biracial 700, I guess. It's like a hybrid. The sneaker still has the same midsole as the previous V1s and the V2s, but the only difference with this sneaker is the upper is totally different. The upper is made with complete nylon. That's it. And with this new design, you can actually see the 3M materials on this sneaker a lot more than the previous model 700s. The front and rear panels of the sneaker is made of 3M, and also the huge 700 that's on the side of the sneaker is made of 3M material as well. Yeah, this is a very, very bright sneaker. Now this sneaker is gonna have four colorways. First colorway that we're gonna have is gonna be an electric yellow. They're trying to call this phosphor Anybody know what a phosphor is? I don't. We're just gonna call it neon yellow. This is a very, very bright sneaker. I'm not really too big on this colorway. To be honest with you, man, I'm tired of neon green Yeezys, man. I love neon green Yeezys, I love it, but you know what I mean, I'm, this this might be overkill. Now the second colorway that we're gonna talk about is the bone white colorway. The whole upper of the sneaker is gonna be made in a bone white, off white, cream white whatever you want to call it now i actually think this color looks okay it doesn't really blow me away but one thing i am hoping is that the upper part the white part of the sneaker it actually be 3m if that part is actually made to 3m that would be awesome no one knows yet because we see nothing but mock-ups and drafts and rough drafts i haven't seen a, a a first hand look at the sneaker yet but that is my wish list with that color the third color that we want to talk about is going to come in an orange colorway it's going to be like in a tangerine orange Orange. It's gonna be like a vibrant bright orange. I actually think this colorway looks super dope. Engaging the height weight of this model of this sneaker, this is probably the most sought after colorway. I think it looks amazing. We already saw a lot of people wear this sneaker. We saw ASAP Rocky wear this sneaker. We done saw, you know what I mean? What's that guy's name? Uh, Sway Lee, that's the guy. His name is Sway Lee. We already saw Sway Lee wear these sneakers and they look amazing. I think this colorway might be the best colorway out the four, in my opinion. And the last colorway that we have there is the triple black 700s, which I think is actually one of the fan favorites. It's not the orange, this is definitely gonna be an instant sellout. This sneaker just looks amazing. I think the 3M that shines on this sneaker just looks incredible. I love this sneaker. We're gonna talk about the releasing of this sneaker. These sneakers are going to be super limited, super limited. And if you wanna get your hand on the sneaker, man, you gotta, you gotta basically travel. You gotta hop on an airplane and get those frequent flight mileage is going. This is going to be an in-store only release and it's only going to be in three places, New York, Tokyo, and London. Wow. It's going to be in all Adidas select retailers. It's only going to be in two stores in New York, but it's going to be in a handful of stores in Japan and London, and I am totally depressed about that. If you do manage to get your hands on this sneaker for retail, you're going to have a nice little come up. I'm telling you, you are. Right now, the triple black 700s are going for about $500 in a size 10 on my size. You'll also get the orange 700s as well too, but they are currently being priced at two grand. Oh my God. These are going to be a hype and limited release. Therefore, it's going to be worth a lot of money. So if you're not lucky, 
lucky enough to be in one of those three places on release day, you might gonna have to buy resale. And if you're gonna do that, say goodbye to your tax return because it's gonna be gone. The Triple Black 700s is expected to be released this Saturday, February 8th for $220. While the Orange 700s, they are expected to be released later this month, February 28th. And they're also gonna cost $220. It feels good not spending $300 on these sneakers. Oh my God, it feels so good. And for the last two pairs, the Bone white 700s and also the electric neon green 700s they are expected to drop march or in april later this spring they're also expected to be 220 dollars when they drop as well too there goes all the information that we have on these sneakers make sure you guys let me know which pair are you excited for which is your favorite colorway and are you guys copping make sure you guys holler at me in the comments until then i see you guys when i see you peace